Progress on the post-COVID Transport Action Plan has been rapid, and that's why I can offer an update today over further measures as they relate to one of the priorities, schools. Back last year, we engaged with the entire school community within Richmond, offering them the opportunity to work with Richmond Council over the development of school street proposals. Three schools came forward, Twickenham Primary Academy, GEMS, St Stephen's Church of England School and Orleans Primary School. These schools worked with us closely to develop proposals and we were in a position to consult on them earlier this year. Sadly, however, COVID intervened and we didn't have the opportunity to go out there and engage with residents. However, COVID has done more than intervene. It has increased the need for measures like these. Never before have we needed more uh, social distancing outside our schools. Never more have we needed to ensure that people are encouraged to come to school by sustainable means. And that's why Richmond Council can today announce that under emergency measures, we will be implementing these three school streets. I also want to take the opportunity to talk directly to parents, governing bodies and head teachers around the borough and to say that Richmond Council stands ready, indeed committed, to working with you over a second tranche of these proposals. If you come to us now and we engage collaboratively, we believe that we can implement many more school streets in time for the resumption of the new academic year in September. These three school streets that are announced through emergency measures are unique. They are the first of their kind in this borough. I hope very much that they are not the last. This council will continue to work hard to ensure that our environment shifts to reflect the change that COVID has made. I hope that like me, you think this is a welcome development and there will be many more such announcements to make in the coming weeks. Thank you.